You have to catch livestock. Oh, we're going to have fun. Before you can save them from a disaster. It's why Greta Cook prepares for the worst by practicing a quick escape. Another. Come on. Good boy. Cook co-founded the Washington State Animal Response Team after Hurricane Katrina. It's easier to evacuate small animals, but Western Washington is full of big ones. Uh, emergency identification. This is critical, especially if uh, if something came off of uh, what you uh, what you normally keep on your animal. Um, this is really easy to put around my horse's neck. Uh, this is actually generally used for cattle um, or sometimes goats, but it works great for the horses. Uh, this is a temporary writable ID that can go over your smaller animals, and. Then we've, uh, we've got little you know, reflective ID that, that we can write the number where we're going to be going. Cook says it's also important to stock between a week and a month's supply of food. Because a, a wide area event could really, um, really isolate us from the rest of the area. And it's going to take time for the supplies to be brought in. So where do you take large animals? Often fairgrounds are used as emergency shelters. And this is the time to make friends uh, and, and get to know people because it might be that you kind of create a buddy system where, hey, if something's going on with me, I'm gonna head to your place, vice versa. In Enumclaw, I'm Allison Morrow, King 5 News.